What is this guy doing at the station at this hour? My gosh. That dude's like 7-3. Yeah, you couldn't pay me enough. <laughs> yeah, you can. Oh my gosh. I am hungry. Can I eat you? No. I may have made a slight miscalculation. I don't think homeboy is 7-3. I think he's like 8-5. God is dead. Ooh, buddy. No, he is not. He is very much alive. Where are you, Vulture? I'm about to send you to him. Hey everybody, my name is Blee, and tonight we're playing Homeless. Hope you guys enjoy. Thank you all so much for joining me for... There were some drops in frames there for a second. I don't know how this is going to run. Brooklyn, New York, 1998. Thank you guys for joining me for this uh, video tonight. As always, I appreciate you guys tuning in, dropping by, checking my stuff out. Always means a whole lot to me, so thank you guys. Oh, real. So yeah, this game, I found it last night on Steam called homeless and okay i hate this city no i don't curse not about it not doing it the rich are up in their penthouses enjoying life while the poor are down on the streets struggling for a bite to eat my whole 45 years they promised me i'd get up there one day but it was it was allies i'm still stuck down here forced to guard these trains for peanuts these flipping trains for peanuts so yeah i don't know how this game's gonna run, I hope well, but you know, you never know. Uh, but yeah, I found this game last night and on Steam and it looked pretty dope. I think it's just gonna be another another walking simulator type game. Although I think I saw a shotgun, so maybe not entirely a walking simulator. Um, but I saw a big scary tall man in the, in the video, uh, like the little trailer. Uh, so it looked kind of cool. The graphics looked good. And so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna throw seven bucks at it. I'm gonna pick it up, I'm gonna try it out, and I hope that you guys love it. Hope I do too, hope it runs well, because it looks pretty good, and so far it looks pretty good. Looks like it's, looks like everything's running pretty well. So, hopefully it just, uh, hopefully we keep it up here. All right, shut the door, shut the door. So I think the idea is I'm a security guard, I think, or a guard, I don't know, it'll, it'll explain, let's see. Okay, your ID card. Yeah, so Metro Security Agency, Albert Smith, Security Officer, blah, 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 okay. All right, dear team, it has come to our attention that there has been an increase in incidents where homeless individuals seek refuge within the station confines overnight. While we empathize with their plight, their presence poses significant safety risks to both themselves and our patrons. Monitoring station entrances ensure all entry points are monitored regularly throughout the night to deter unauthorized access. Prompt reporting, immediately report any sightings or attempts of unauthorized individuals trying to enter restricted areas of the station. Compassionate engagement. When encountered, engage with homeless individuals with compassion and guide them towards appropriate support services outside the station premises. Thank you for your attention to this matter, Chief Officer NYC Subway System Security. Okay, well, I imagine that the that step number three, compassionate engagement, is going to just result in me blasting this homeless dude in the face with a shotgun. Oh, I gotta go check those CCTV cameras again. I'm beat. All right, let's see. Okay, so I'm just clicking into them individually. Okay, oh man, another power out. Just gotta go fix this issue. Okay, I wonder if I should check all these though. Should I? I don't know. Am I gonna see something here that's gonna spook me? Okay, well, so far everything looks pretty normal. Just looks like a creepy metro station. No unauthorized. Oh, that's me. I think everything looks normal. Everything looks like it's in place, so... That's good. I'll tell you what I wish. I wish I had, I wish I had, I could just grab, I wish I could just get a shotgun real quick, you know, just for some peace of mind. Not that I would use it. I'm all about compassionate engagement, but you know, that only goes so far. At some point, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? If it comes to it, you know, I'd like to have the option to escalate the situation if need be. That's all I'm saying. Um saved uh okay all right whoa lag okay hopefully that clears up yeah it looks okay we'll see might have to tinker with the settings if it's uh if it if it becomes unplayable but so far so good also what i'm noticing is i can't oh i can jump super high my gosh <laughs> my head <laughs> my head hits the ceiling um what I'm noticing so far is I can't run, or wait, can I? Hang on. 
just barely. There's there's like no difference whatsoever. It's like a brisk walk. <laughs> All right. So maybe in here. That looks like the issue. I need a key. You would think that you would have come prepared, man. I mean, you are the security guard after all. You'd think that you would have a key on you, you know? A little key ring on your belt, right next to your shotgun that you should have had on your belt all along. Uh, I don't think this was lit up last time, but it's probably normal. <laughs> okay. Okay. Don't know what that was. Yeah, no clue what that was about. That was a, that was an interesting one. Interesting jump scare there. Wasn't prepared for that one. All right, I guess I'm just gonna follow the lights. Usually that's the, the idea in these types of games. I gotta say, this game looks pretty darn good. Pretty good. I love games like this. Oh, here we go. Got my key. Uh, um, what was I gonna say? Yeah, this game. This game looks good. Wait, what is this? Trash. Well, I don't need that. Hopefully I find a flashlight soon. Or a shotgun. I'll take either one. Preferably a shotgun. Um, okay, so I got the key. I got the key. Let's just go back. Let's just go back. I don't... I don't need to wander around too much here. Uh... Alright. Okay, I'm feeling a little bit jumpy. Um... But it's okay. We'll get through it. It's gonna be... Okay. What? What? Nah, I'm good. All right. Okay, let's go. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Let's go check it out. Hello? Hello? Anybody back here? I heard footsteps. I heard footsteps back here. Oh my gosh. It is so dark back here. Hey. Just your friendly, my gosh. It goes so far back here, guys. All right. Yeah, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Let's make it exciting, huh? Let's make it exciting. We're all fine, right? We're all good. We're all good. This is what we're here for. We're here for the, we're here for this. This is what we're here for. This is what my channel's all about, is, is all this, is this right here. This is, what we're, this is what we're supposed to do. Don't be afraid of the shadows and the alleys. It's me watching you. Perfect. I'm sweating already. Already. All right. Okay. All right. I'm not going that way. That is pitch black down there. Guys, this one's tough. This one's tough. I, I'm, I am sweating. Literally sweating. Palms are wet. I honestly don't know. Wait, can I use this? I don't know what it is, truthfully, because I feel like some of these games, he's walking. Okay. Lost family, lost home, lost everything. Yeah, I don't know why some of these walking simulators don't get me as bad. <sighs> and some do. This one already is, is tough. I don't like this at all. I don't like this at all. Oh my gosh. It, I, I am so far back here. Oh my gosh. All right. All right. All right. This is what I'm here for. This is what we're all here for. This is literally what my channel's about. It's scary games. But some are worse than others. And right now, right now, right now, this one's pretty bad. Okay. You will never... You will never take us alive. Oh, 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 okay. I don't want to take you anywhere, man. Honestly, I just, I'm, I'm wanting to check in on you to see if you're, see if you're, if you have everything you need down here. Just your friendly security guard, just checking in on you. Okay, all right. Oh, okay. All right, all right, okay, let's let's just go. Let's just go, let's just go. Likely another homeless has entered the area again. Yeah, I don't think it's just another homeless guy though. I've seen the screenshots. Oh, I'm back. Okay, 
So it's a it's a loop. Is that right? Is that what I'm gathering? Oh man. Let's go back to the station. Oh, hang on. I see something. What is this guy doing at the station at this hour? My gosh. That dude's like 7-3. Yeah, you couldn't pay me enough. <laughs> yeah, you can oh my gosh. We have to remember one thing and one thing only compassionate engagement whenever crap hits the fan and we know it's gonna we have to remember step three compassionate is the name of the game compassion so i'm not going back down to the subway yet so hopefully i'm gonna come down here okay well i guess this is i this is okay okay yeah yeah let's take the ladder let's take the ladder down into where am I going? Am I going back into the subway station? Oh, frames. Okay. Hopefully it's just... Hopefully these frames will settle out. Because I really want you guys to have the most enjoyable... The most enjoyable experience possible. That is my goal. You know? Okay. Alright. Alright, let's just get this... Honestly, let's just get this over with. Cause it food. Let's just, let's just press on. Okay. What's in here? What do I need in here? There's a shop! I was gonna ask if it was a shotgun, but no. That's definitely not a shotgun. That is a cooked human head. Is that a buzzsaw going off? What? Where did this door come from? Holy moly. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. I can't see Jack in this in this environment. Am I supposed to turn this? Bro. Brother. What is this? Special special fruit juice order for vulture. Blend of human eye and brain. Vulture's got an odd taste for juice. He needs to try just some simple orange juice. Yeah? You ever tried that, buddy? It's pretty good. Maybe we try that. Maybe we skip the whole human. Oh, oh my gosh. I saw him. I saw him walk. I saw him walk right here. Is this locked? No, it's not locked. Okay. Sounded like there was a locking sound, but I guess not. I guess it was just to get my attention on Vulture walking by. All right. This is where we're going. Man, I just know something's going to happen very soon. And honestly, like, I don't know if my heart's going to be able to handle it. I scream my loneliness amidst crowded streets, but no one hears. I hate this. I hate that. I hate that it does this dead end, and then it makes me turn around. <sighs> Not gonna lie, guys. Not gonna lie. My heart might explode tonight. I don't know what it is. I don't know if it's if it's just the night, if it's just if it's just the game, if it's just the fact that I chugged 300 milligrams of caffeine less than three hours ago. I don't know what what it is. But all I know is I've got minor chest pain. That's all I know. Okay, locked. Of course locked. Why would it not be locked? There we go again. Okay. I hate it. I hate it when it makes me turn around because uh, I just, I hate it. Uh. <laughs> okay. My hands are clammy. My hands and my toes are clammy. All right, let's shut this door. Let's shut that door. Let's shut that door. What is this? Kronf. Don't need. Won't take. Now let's turn this off. Can we, can we shut up? <sighs> He's messing up all the systems. I thought I shut you. I thought, can I not shut this? Okay. Archive of old photos. Manufacturing trains, cabins. Okay, okay, that's normal. That's pretty normal. Nothing abnormal in there. All right, how about this? Anything in here? Anything? Let's see. The visit of the mayor, Brooklyn Station. Okay, pretty normal. That yeah, it's kind of weird, right? On the far right. Actually, they all look kind of weird. Something tells me we're gonna see this giant of a homeless man creeping in the background. What do you know? 1924. Wasn't this in the 1990s? So dude's at least like, what, 70 years old? I'm trying not to stall. I'm trying to... I'm trying to uh, keep the pace here. I'm trying to keep the pace, but it is not easy. This game is not, it, it's just not, this is, this is just, a, this is just a big, big pile of not. 
big pile of nope. <sighs> okay. I guess I'm wandering into the women's room for whatever reason. Dude, if you're chilling in one of these stalls, if you're chilling in one of these stalls, bro, first of all, that's messed up. Second of all, I'm gonna die. This game is rough. I'm not even joking. Yeah, yeah, I saw that one coming. Nope. All right, you do your thing, man. I'm not even gonna stay. I'm not even gonna stick around. You do your thing. You do your thing. There's gonna be another dead body in here. Let me guess. I called it and I still jumped. Well, I think we know where this guy's head is. It's in the microwave. All right. Subject agreement for transfer of penthouse in Manhattan. Both parties acknowledge that the penthouse is being sold in its current condition and no warranties or guarantees are provided. August 8th, 1998, seller. Mr. Robert Cooper, buyer vulture. Okay. Dismiss. And back out and close. And slowly turn. Check our surroundings. Frames are 43. Everything's looking up. Not really, because the killer's probably returning to the crime scene. I need to hide here. Okay, sure. Let's hide. Can I crouch? What am I doing? Am I just chilling here? I guess I'm just chilling here. Okay, we'll just chill here. have made a slight miscalculation. I don't think homeboy is 7-3. I think he's like 8-5. Okay, uh, across all of the scary games I've played, this guy, this creature, homeless man, absolute Goliath of a human being is one of the most unnerving, without a doubt. Oh boy, okay, alrighty. All right, let's close you. We were never here. We were never here. All right, guys, what do we say? Compassionate engagement. What do we say when we're scared? Compassionate engagement. What do we say whenever our lives are being threatened? That's right, compassionate engagement. Okay, I'm not gonna do that yet. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Uh, it's always a good, it's always a good time to, to, to be going down farther into the darkness. This is what we're here for, to go down into the depths of the subway station, perform our duty as New York's finest security guard, Metro Station security guard, and to make sure the homeless are, are being taken care of uh, and not killing everybody. I'm just here to do a job and go home to the family. That's all I'm trying to do. Okay, so I need a key code. I need a code. I need a code. Okay, so, oh. Oh, okay. All right. So set. Okay. Seven, three, eight, seven. Seven, three, eight, seven. Seven, three, eight, seven. All right. Please let me in. Please shut that. Shut that behind me. I gotta say, this game definitely builds on itself very well so far. It has been building on itself very, very well. Also, this chair, what is this about? It says comfort redesigned, but that literally looks like it was pulled from a dump. It's not what I'm here for. We're here to do a job, and most importantly, to do a good job, and most, most importantly, to provide compassionate engagement. Got those morning Monday blues? Take happy, be happy. Beat the Mondays, take happy. Uh, no thank you. My body is a temple. I don't do the drugs. Bro. Okay. Okay. All right. I'm gonna have to turn this light, aren't I? Here we go, let's turn the light. Hey, please leave me alone, I have no shelter. Oh, you seem like a normal homeless guy. Who are you? What are you doing here? I don't mess with anyone, please leave me alone, I have no shelter, please. Don't worry, my friend, I won't harm you. I just want to know if you've seen a tall homeless man named Vulture around here. I've been here the whole time and I don't know any other homeless people, please don't kick me out. Yeah, you're good, dude. I won't kick you out. You are literally the least of my concerns. Let me, let me get that light out of your face. Here, hang on. Okay, well, sorry about that. Alrighty, buddy, you just hang in there. Try to avoid 
Vulture, if you can. I don't think he's that nice of a guy. Just a hunch I have. Just a subtle hunch I have with the fact that he's been leaving decapitated bodies in restrooms. Um. <sighs> okay, here's my guess. We're gonna get closer and that light's gonna go out. I'm hugging this wall. My gosh, this thing is... Yep, knew it. Knew it. Proceed this way and uh, click that and, and get out. Am I back on the surface? I hope I am because I really want to not be down there. <gasps> oh, I'm here. Okay, cool. All right, so it looped around. I gotta call the cops right now before I become his next meal. I probably would have done that as soon as I saw his height and his glowing eyes on that CCTV camera, but. That's just me. I'm no professional security guard like yourself. Phone's dead. Yeah, wouldn't you know. Oh, here we go. It feels like this guy wants to turn my night into a total nightmare. He already is. It was a nightmare five, 10, it was a nightmare 30 minutes ago, okay? I am hungry, can I eat you? No, no you can't. This is actually unnerving. Can I eat you? Why? Why would you want to do that? You are sick in the head. If it doesn't give me a shotgun soon. No, 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 I, I'm not. I will finish this game. There's no question. I'm gonna, we're gonna fin- We're gonna finish this game. We're gonna finish this game. But it would make my night better if it gave me a shotgun. That's just, that's just the fact. It just make my my night a little my job down here as the as New York's finest security metro security guard officer make my night and make my night tons better. Let's grab this box. Wait, hang on. Oh, hold on. Oh, <laughs> what? It's right click, not left click. Okay. Well, that I didn't understand. Okay, now I do. There we go. Why can I, how, why can I jump like seven feet? Am I just like the most fit, athletically peak performance individual in, in all of New York? I mean, look at this. That's gotta be like a 50 inch vertical. It is unfortunate that we can't run. We can jump, but we can't run. Man, this really stinks. You would think that I, have, I would have keys on me just to get through these doors. This way. Don't mind me, Vulture. I'll just go the other way. I'll leave you over there by yourself. I'll come over here, this dead end, and turn this valve for whatever, for whatever reason. For whatever reason, it just looked like it needed to be turned. So I'll turn it. <sighs> Still over here? I don't see you. Okay. 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 Okie dokie. Okie dokie. My golly. Okay, I got a couple gripes. One, my back is sweating now. Two, two. How am I a security guard with no flashlight, no means of protecting myself outside of compassionate engagement, but like no weapon, not even a flashlight. A flashlight, come on. Like that, that seems like step one. Day one, hey man, welcome to the job. Here's your duty flashlight. Knock yourself out. I don't even know where I'm going. What am I supposed to do in here? There's nothing even in here for me. Ugh, this sucks, man. No, I'm not gonna lie. Guys, this kind of sucks. Ugh. Okay. Let's just stay calm. Hey, we should try that. We should try <laughs> Chest pain's gone. Chest pain's gone, but heart rate has doubled. That's where we are. What happened? Did I just die? Am I, how, am I, how am I here? How do I get here? This neighborhood looks familiar. Yeah, how did I get here? What is going on? Man. All right. I was thinking that I would have like a minute of like, I don't know, a minute of just calmness, of, of respite or respite or however you pronounce it. But nope, it just throws us right back in. It just throws us right back into this absolute nightmare 
of a night. Ooh, okay. All right, I just gotta remember to breathe. Excuse me. <sighs> Who are you, dude? Why are you even in here? You have a nice night. Watch out for Vulture. Alright. Okay. There's some weirdo creeps in this neighborhood. Some absolute chilling citizens. Honestly, guys, this game... I remember... I remember back when I first started YouTubing. Um, getting into these games. These walking simulators. And one of the first ones that I played... One of the first ones I played... Actually, it may have been the... May have been the first one I played was oh <laughs> oh come on bro oh my gosh that just gave me tingles down my whole body okay all right I just I gotta walk toward it I can't you know I can't be a scaredy cat I gotta I gotta test it I gotta try him out try it out I gotta I gotta stand my ground I can't let Vulture know that I'm scared of him is what I'm trying to say I think one of the first games I played. It may have been the first one. I don't know. Welcome to Kowloon was one of the first games I played like this. Walking simulator. Horror style walking simulator game. And um, it was like the scariest game I played at the time. But then I've played several since then. Um, and they've been scary. Don't get me wrong. But they... I don't know. I feel like maybe I've just gotten used to them. And I kid you not. I was thinking about this like as recently as like two days ago. I was like, you know, I wonder if I'll ever... Uh, feel that same fear again. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it right now. Mr. Smith, due to unpaid rent totaling $1,550, this letter serves as formal notice that you must vacate the property by 4872. 72. Please remove all belongings and leave the property in good condition by this date. Sincerely, your landlord. So did I just go back in time? Or has, the, <laughs> has that just been up there for 20 years? That eviction notice. I think this might be the house we lived in when I was a kid. Oh. Is there a head in this microwave or this uh this oven? No. Thank goodness. No more heads and ovens for us tonight, huh? Let's try to finish this game out with no more decapitation. I think that sounds like a plan. A good plan. That we should stick to. Alright, there's nothing in here. There's nothing. Alright, anything in here? A shotgun, perhaps? Nope. Just dirty needles. Some old pills. Locked, locked. All right, this looks like a substantial size cabinet. One that could easily house a shotgun. I'm hoping. I'm hoping there is a shotgun. And here, there is not. There's one shirt. No shotgun, huh? That's fine, we don't need it. We don't even need a shotgun. We got, we got compassionate engagement. <laughs> That's all we need. That's all we need. In the end, is just a little bit of compassionate. I lost my car, can someone find it? Coming! One second, on my way. Who is it? Okay. Well, I can't even open my own door. Oh wait, here we go. All right, I got your car, buddy. Here you go. Here's your car. It's okay, buddy. Hey, I'm here, man. He hates this city just like I do. And what was your first clue? Hey, man. Sounds like you just need a hug. Come here. Let me give you a hug. Let me wrap my arms around your knees. Come here, buddy.
Wait, so... Did I kill? You are the killer. It wasn't my fault. I didn't kill you. Oh, wait, so... Did he... Oh my gosh, it is dark. Okay. Did he convince me to kill somebody? Lost family. Lost everything. Okay, I've seen that one before. <laughs> um... So, ooh, a shotgun! That's all we needed. There we go. Pistol added to inventory. Well, I don't think that's a pistol. Wants me to take the fall for murder. I gotta kill him. What? <laughs> what? But did I kill? Uh, did I kill somebody? Because it looked like I did. Also, this is not a pistol. This is a, <laughs> this is straight up a shotgun. All right, let's see if this works. Ooh. Beautiful. And kablam! Alright, I feel way more prepared to provide excellent, compassionate engagement. That's what I feel. God is dead. Ooh, buddy. No, he is not. He is very much alive. Where are you, Vulture? I'm about to send you to him. Where you at, big guy? I'm waiting. I'm waiting. Oh. Oh, there he is. Wait, 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 wait! Wait a minute! I'm dead? What? I shot that guy point blank. In the face, no less, with a 12 gauge shotgun. You can be 8-5 all day, but you take a slug to the face, shotgun, blast to the cranium, and just one is all it takes. I'm pretty confident. Let's tango, buddy. Round two. I'm ready. I'm ready. Can I run backwards? Okay, I can go backwards. All right, so let's, let's deal with this guy once and for all. Let's just start blasting immediately. Okay. All right, that went a lot better. That went a lot better. All right, so I think we just have to... Was it four shots? I think it was about four shots. Four shots. Uh, I think that's about right. All right. Where you at, buddy? I feel like you're going to be right around this corner. <laughs> no way, dude. No way! All right, we just gotta be slow about it. That's all we gotta do. We just have to be a little bit more uh, conscientious with our movement. We can't just run straight toward him because he's he's actually kind of quick. All right. Come on, come on, dude, please. Let's dance. Okay. Woo. Yeah. So we gotta be. We just gotta be careful. I. It's definitely, obviously, it's doable. But we just have to kind of be slow with it, I guess. I guess? I don't know. I feel like it's that way because the lights. Let's go this way. No, okay, I was I was wrong. Oh, there's lights this way. Okay, well, never mind. I guess uh, it's not always in the direction of the lights or just where I'm thinking it's going to be. All right, there he is. Got him. Got him. Done. Done. Man, those eyes are horrifying. He's grinning. Oh, he's not done. Oh, he's not done. Albert, after killing Vulture, reported the incident to the police. Crime, the crime police found no evidence. Uh, oh my gosh, I can't read. The crime police found no trace of a body or any evidence of Vulture's existence. Albert tried to convince the officers that the murder of the man in the bathroom was Vulture's doing, but based on the evidence, the police concluded that Albert was a psychopath. He committed the murder himself. Albert was prosecuted and spent the rest of his life in a mental institution. Dang. It's pretty dark. Yeah, it's just gonna show what we saw before was him in the photo, yeah. There he is, there's our buddy Vulture. Back in the 70s, 20s, 20s, right? Wasn't that photo in the 20s? Well guys, that's it for me. Thank you all so much for joining me for my playthrough of Homeless. I really enjoyed it and I hope you guys did too. Hope to see you all in the next video and until then, take care.